Good morning, everyone. I, uh, I'm out running errands, and I just thought I would do a quick update. Just to blabber at you guys and tell you what I'm doing today and all that good stuff. Um, actually, I'm just running errands. <laughs> I'm not really doing anything else at the moment. I babysit on Monday, Tuesday, and Friday, so I had yesterday and today off from babysitting, um, but I had 2,000 other things to do, so I didn't actually chillax or anything like that, <laughs> for the most part. I was going to tell you something. Oh, I got some Vita Muffins. I don't know if you guys are familiar with those. You can buy them at Harris Teeter, where I live. Uh, and I think you can buy them at Lowe's Foods, where I live. And I think you can buy them at other, like, higher-end grocery stores. I don't think you can get them at, like, Walmart, but, you know, things like that. Um, I didn't get them there. I ordered them from the company because they had a deal. They had a news flavor, banana chocolate chip, and if you ordered a dozen of those, you got another dozen for half price or something? I don't remember. No, $3. So I ended up paying $27 for 24 muffins, but I know that sounds like a lot, but it's not. <laughs> um, because if you buy them in the grocery store, they are $5.50, $5.99, something ridiculous for four muffin tops, which I never buy because that's absurd. Uh, so I got 24 for 27 and I didn't do the math on that. It may be more. I don't know But I figured it was worth Doing it one time when they had a deal because then I would have 24 muffin tops in the freezer that no one else is allowed to eat <laughs> And you have to freeze them um, So when you want to eat one you can just set it out on the counter wait till it thaws and it doesn't take long Or you can put it in the microwave or you can put it in the toaster the oven whatever you want to do so the two flavors that I got were the new banana chocolate chip flavor and I got an apple crumb flavor and they're both really good. They are very high in fiber. One has eight grams and one has nine. Um, they each have one gram of fat. They're both 100 calories. They both have like 20, one has 23 carbs, one has 25. Um, and I think they both have five grams of protein, I want to say, maybe six I don't know anyway um, the banana chocolate chip are two points the apple crumb are three points I tried them both cold not cold but not warmed up just straight from the box when I got them yesterday um, because I had the points to blow <laughs> but I think I would like both of them better warmed up but I am a warm muffin type person anyway so they're definitely tasty um, they're not like you would think usually when a muffin only has one gram of fat it's like a dried out piece of toast <laughs> they're not like that they're good so anyways that's my update for that I cannot weigh in tomorrow and I'm really struggling with this I don't know what to do here um, I am babysitting my nephew on Fridays and I have to pick him up as soon as humanly possible in the morning so that my sister can start working because um, it's, you know, it's just hard to have a three-year-old running around the house screaming. You're trying to keep him quiet. It's just difficult. So, I don't know what to do. I don't want to go on Saturdays. It's not going to work out for me. I know that. The only day that I could go, days uh, that I could go, is Wednesday and Thursday. And I don't want to go either one of those days because when I did Weight Watchers the last time, years ago... I think four years ago, five. Um, I went on Wednesdays and it never worked out well for me. I always had bad weigh-ins. It seemed like, I don't remember all the reasons, I just remember it really feeling like it kind of set me up to fail to weigh in on Wednesday. Um, and, and I can't really see Thursday being any better. But maybe I'll just try Thursdays from now on. I should have maybe tried it today, I just thought about it. Sorry, I'm talking to you guys and thinking about it at the same time. So from now on, I guess I'll try Thursday next week. Uh, maybe I'll get to weigh in this Saturday morning. No, I won't. Yeah. Rob and Liz and a couple of our friends are going to a Renaissance festival and I dress, I put makeup on Rob and make him look like a pirate. Um, kind of like a Pirates of the Caribbean style pirate. You know, the dark eyes and the dark face and the tan and the dirt and all that stuff. Um, and I'm going to do the same thing with Liz. Hers will be a little different because she wants to be a female pirate, not a male. So, anyways, I have to do all that Saturday morning before they leave at 10 o'clock. So, weigh-in's not going to happen. Um, 
but this coming Thursday, I will definitely be weighing in and I'll try Thursdays from now on and see how that goes. It's only one day difference, so we'll see. Um, other than that, I don't really have a lot going on right now. Um, I'm eating fine. I'm not still not exercising, um, unless you consider chasing my three-year-old nephew around exercising. <laughs> I guess it is more movement than I was doing, so that's what, that's good. At least three days a week, I'll be chasing his little tail end around. <laughs> um, yeah, so I will show you guys what I do for Rob and Liz for makeup and costume and all that um, for the Renaissance Festival Saturday. I'll probably just record like a few snippets of putting makeup on each of them and then what they look like when they're done. I'm not going to record the whole process because it would take too long and it would be like eight videos and no. I don't think anybody wants to watch all that. But I will record uh, snippets of putting it on them like the stages and then their final costume when they're all dressed and all that stuff. Um, my friend Eric, he never wants me to put makeup on him. He's kind of a got a phobia about that. For some reason he acts like that means he's a girl. I don't know why. He will be in garb, but he won't have makeup on. And then his mom is going as well, and she will be in garb, but I don't think she wants me to do her makeup either, so um, Rob and Liz will be the only two with the war paint. And I'm home, and they're waiting for me to get in there with the goodies that I got um, to do what we need to do. It's not really goodies, it's just stuff. And so... I guess that's it. I had some thoughts going through my head about different things that I heard people saying on videos and things um, and comments on Facebook and everything, but I need to collect them and then I'll just make a video about that and tell you what I've been thinking. Um, other than that, that's my life. It's not a lot, but it's my life. And that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go on in before they come out going, come on, come on, come on, we got to hurry and do this. <laughs> and I will talk to you guys soon. I hope you have a great, what is today? Thursday. <laughs> I need to uh, tape a calendar in my forehead. Hope you have a great Thursday. And I will talk to you guys probably later on this evening because everyone will be gone and I'll be watching live stream at church and all that stuff. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Bye.